Okay, the purpose of this training is to show the user of Canvas how to create a complete quality ticket. And the reason for this is it will expedite the response time and solve your problem quicker. There's two very important things that you need to know. One is that you actually have to be in the course before you set up a ticket and go through the process. And the page that you're on where the error is occurring, you actually have to be the user and explain it in detail. And we're going to go, I'm going to give you an example of that. And the last thing that's very important is in your settings, you have to have an email address set up. This way, communication and correspondence will be quicker and it'll be done via email. Okay, so let's get started. As you can see, I'm in a course as a student. So if this button was not working, I would click here to go to help. This first one is ask your instructor a question. And what that means is it's content related. So if you didn't know how to do a math problem or you didn't understand the word problem, you can ask your instructor a question there. Next one is search the Canvas guides. That is a, a ton of resources that are both in PDF and video. And here's where you can report a problem. I want you to know that you can also report a problem even if um, you have a question, a simple question. Um, and so it's not just an issue with, with Canvas. If you wanted to know how to do something, uh, subject line could be how do I integrate Google Docs? Um, or how I, do I integrate another application? So that's very important to note also. Now. In your subject line, just to give you an example, if this video, getting oriented, wasn't working, let's just say it was a video, I would type in video is not working. And then finally, in my description, I'm going to be very detailed. I'm going to say the video getting oriented, I won't even type it, the video getting oriented is not working. It is the second video um, on the side of the page or wherever it would be located. Um, and maybe I'm getting an error message. I would copy the error message and I would put it in my description. Um, that's about it. And I click on how is it affecting you and you know just answer the question on how it's affecting you. Then go ahead and submit the ticket. Now, the last thing that's very important that you understand is that you've set up your email and to do that you go to settings and right here in this area is um, how you can add an email address um, you can you can see mine is already added so my correspondence with the person that's getting the ticket will be sent to that email and that's the 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 quickest way to expedite a ticket and to create a quality ticket remember it's detailed you're on the page you're actually the user you set up your email and that's all there is to it remember for passwords um, incidentally uh, for students the ICT coach at the school will have all the students passwords for that particular school thank you very much